Crew Dragon is an upgraded version of its Cargo Dragon spacecraft, which has flown to the space station 20 times since it was the first privately constructed spacecraft to transport supplies to the International Space Station. Crew Dragon is the first personally developed spaceship to have humans. Today on the channel, we'll be looking at the Crew Dragon mission, so watch to the end to find out all about this fascinating mission. NASA's Commercial Crew Program collaborates with industry in a public-private partnership to provide safe, dependable, and inexpensive transportation to and from the International Space Station. The space station will continually serve as a launch pad for future Moon and ultimately Mars. NASA's SpaceX Crew-3 mission, including NASA astronauts Raj Ashari, Tom Mashburn, Kayla Barron, and European Space Agency astronaut Matthias Maurer, is launching no later than Sunday, October 31st. Crew-3 will launch from the Launch Complex 39A at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida on a new Crew Dragon spacecraft to begin a six-month research mission aboard the space station. NASA and SpaceX have altered the planned launch and return dates for future human flights to and from the International Space Station depending on the volume of visiting vehicles. This will allow for more research time and increasing the opportunity for discovery aboard humanity's testbed for exploration. Crew-3 astronauts will arrive at the space station for a brief handover with Crew-2 astronauts and other Expedition 66 crew members. Crew-2 NASA astronauts Megan MacArthur and Shane Kimbrough, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency astronaut Aki Hoshide, and ESA astronaut Thomas Pescute plan to return on Earth aboard Crew Dragon Endeavour off the coast of Florida in early to mid-November. Following Crew-3, the next crew rotation mission is scheduled for mid-April 2022. The partner spacecraft and launch vehicle will be decided subsequently. Teams will finish the last primary assessment for NASA's SpaceX Crew-2 mission, which will launch from the agency's Kennedy Space Center in Florida to the International Space Station. NASA and SpaceX will confirm the planned launch time of 6.11 a.m. after the evaluation known as the Launch Readiness Review. NASA astronauts Shane Kimbrough and Megan MacArthur, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency astronaut Akihiko Hoshide and European Space Agency astronaut Thomas Pescute will fly to the International Space Station in the Crew Dragon spacecraft. It will launch from Launch Complex 39A on the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. A pre-launch press conference will be broadcast live on NASA television and the agency's website about an hour after the LRR is completed, no sooner than 8 a.m. Participants will include the media and they will only ask questions via phone. They can contact the Kennedy Newsroom for connection information. Crew-2 is the second crew rotation trip of a commercial spacecraft from the United States to the International Space Station and the first to transport two international crew members. The Crew-2 astronauts would join the other members of Expedition 65, NASA astronaut Mark Van de Hei and Roscosmos cosmonauts Oleg Novitsky and Piotr Dubrov for a six-month mission in low Earth orbit to perform scientific experiments. The continuation of a series of tissue chips and space investigations is a primary scientific emphasis on this mission. Tissue chips are tiny replicas of human organs that include numerous cell types similar to those found in the body. Other microgravity scientific experiments will be conducted as well as maintenance and improvements to the space station. Based on Falcon 9 Crew Dragon launch weather requirements, the United States Space Force 45th Weather Squadron forecast an 80% probability of good weather conditions at the launch pad for NASA's SpaceX Crew-2 mission liftoff. This follows the latest in a series of reviews for a second crew rotation mission to the International Space Station with astronauts on an American rocket and spacecraft from NASA, the United States, and SpaceX. Managers and engineers are preparing for the Crew-2 mission to the International Space Station to launch no earlier than 6.11 a.m. Liftoff winds will be the main weather issue for the launch location. Teams will also monitor weather conditions in the launch region and downrange during Crew Dragon's flight. The most recent assessment held by the International Space Station program is one of many that involves SpaceX and the Commercial Crew program, culminating in the Flight Readiness Review. That FRR officially establishes the launch time and date. The Crew-1 crew is also planning to move the Crew Dragon resilient spacecraft from one space station docking port to another on April 5th to free the preferred position for Crew-2's arrival. This is the start of a procedure that will enable Crew-2 to dock to the Harmony Node 2 forward port. 
It will free up the Node 2 Zenith port to extract the new solar arrays from the trunk of the SpaceX CRS-22 cargo mission when it arrives. Crew 2 will be the first flight in NASA's commercial crew program to carry two foreigner partner crew members. NASA astronauts Shane Kimbrough and Megan MacArthur will command and pilot the spacecraft respectively. European Space Agency astronaut Thomas Pescute and Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency astronaut Akihoko Hoshide will be mission experts. Crew 1 NASA astronaut Michael Hopkins, Shannon Walker, Victor Glover, and JAXA astronaut Sochi Noguchi aim to return home off the coast of Florida approximately five days after Crew 2 arrives at the space station and mission goals and weather agree. What are your thoughts about the extraordinary space mission? Let us know in the comments section. If you enjoyed watching this video, hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.